Here with Ivica Zubats after today's win uh, for the defenders over the Reno Bighorns. Ivica, uh, I know this was kind of a rough night for you, fouled out pretty quickly, yeah. but as a team, what did you think was uh, the key to this win? Uh, the key was sticking together, everybody. The, they called everything on us, so we had to stick together, and that's what we did. We moved the ball well, and we won. We're a better team. Right. There, there was a lot of fouls called and uh, a lot obviously called on you, but you managed to stay in rhythm for the most part, especially considering the fouls. Uh, I think you shot 6 of 10, and you scored 12 points. Uh, what was the key for you, even though that was kind of a difficult situation? I don't know what was the key. I, I think I played a really bad game. I mean, I did my best, but referees and some other things got me out of games, game and... I don't know. <laughs> let, me, let me ask you about the Lakers, because you, you have been practicing with them again since they came back from the road trip. Uh, what, what has it been like kind of shuffling back and forth here in LA? It's good. I mean, I'm practicing with them, getting better every day, and I'm not getting any minutes, so it's good to get back here and have some minutes. So you're going to see a lot of shuffling back and forth this week. It's going to be a lot of it. Is that challenging at all, uh, considering that you kind of have to keep your wind up both ways? I mean, that's my job. I mean, I have to do it. It's not something a lot of, I don't want to do it. I want to do it, and I look forward to every game, and I want to play as much as games I can. Last thing for you, Zoo. Uh, you're officially around the, the quarter point of your first season. Uh, what's what's just been the the overall temperature with both the defenders and the Lakers for you? <sighs> I'm getting to know how it's be how it is to be a rookie in this in the NBA. Uh, it's hard to get chance. You gotta really work hard for everything, and you gotta just gotta be ready and wait for your opportunity because you never know when it's going to come and just work hard every day. All right, thanks man. I appreciate your time.